what the various chips are. So I guess this is a CPU, and this looks like the companion chip. And this might be the memory, yeah. And uh, this looks like the embedded flash. Mm, this could be the BIOS flash instead. Uh, do we still have the, the EC? Yeah. This is Bernie Inesetti taking apart the new XO 1.5. He's had the machine in his hands for maybe 20 minutes. And he's already taken it apart. So, can we describe the parts for the camera? Sure. So, microprocessor, and this is probably the companion chip that does like looks very much like a Southbridge. And this should be the flash drive, and uh, this should be the memory. Uh, this looks very much like the could be the cafe, and uh, but I can't recognize the names here. So, and this guy here could be the display controller. But I still don't recognize the brand. Cheapo. <laughs> so, oh, here is the embedded controller. So we still have it. This little guy here is responsible for the power management and all the, the, I mean, like for making this, the, the thing come up. Is there a wireless LAN card on the other side? It's like a daughter card. Uh, so, do the you notice any big, big difference there, Bernie? Oh, well, it's quite, quite different. This is a completely different processor. Completely Configuration? Different. Yeah, the, the whole thing is... I should, I should be showing them next to each other. I thought that the board was kind of smaller than the old one, but I don't see any difference in size. Theoretically, they're the exact same size, so you could actually take a XO 1.5 motherboard and put it in an XO 1.0 computer. Oh, okay. So that's what this is, right? Yeah, essentially this is what it is. It's a 1.5 board and a 1.1 computer. You will need, however, This is probably the wire. Eventually you'll need a new charger. The peak power usage is higher. Oh, oh. I didn't give a shit yet about it. Y'all bitch case, yeah, I'm gonna lie. Yeah.